Welcome to the Cooking Corner. We're happy to welcome back Natalie Michaels with the Made in Oklahoma Coalition doing kitchen sink cookies. Yes. We're so glad you could join us Thank today. Thank you. And I will say I've already tried them and they're amazing. You did. You got a sneak peek. A sneak peek. <laughs> yes. Okay. I, I may have had them for breakfast too. I'm just saying. They're so really they good. are very good. <laughs> so, you know, we're starting off with just a really kind of basic cookie mixture. I've got two sticks of Highland butter. I'm going to add to that one cup of brown sugar and one quarter cup of just white granulated sugar. I'm going to add one egg and we'll add a teaspoon of vanilla. And I'm using Griffin's Vanilla, which is made in Oklahoma in a delicious vanilla. Always promoting those Oklahoma yes, products. Yes, absolutely. Now at home, you're going to want to beat this really thoroughly. I mean, maybe, you know. How long do you feel like it'll three take? Three to five minutes. Okay. I mean, it needs to be really light and fluffy, which we have already done. Oh, look at TV magic. <laughs> so, yes, so here it is. And you can see, you know, this has really been mixed well. And I mean, this part is so delicious. I could just eat it on its own, <laughs> butter and sugar. So now we're going to add the flour. And we're going to add two and one quarter cups of flour and I've done this a few times so I know about how much we need. And um, this is Shawnee Mills flour. Shawnee Mills, made in Oklahoma, been around Oklahoma forever and such a great Oklahoma company and kind of one of those staples you know you just have to have in your in your pantry. Right. And we're going to add um, a half a one teaspoon of baking soda and one half teaspoon of salt. So add that in. And then we'll give this just a little bit of a mix. So this you can just, you know, beat on kind of a low mixture is fine. And how long that. does that, how long do you need to mix it for? Not long. This okay. will be just really until it's combined. Okay. So we won't do this too long. And so then this we'll is like a quick and easy sweet dish. It really is. I mean, this is something you can make very quickly. After this flour is mixed in, we're going to add the goodies, which make it because so delicious. Because it's nothing like the sweet. It, yes. I know. I could. Yes. I tasted them in the cookies, and they are really good. Oh, for sure. So there are mixtures pretty well combined. These are Bedray chocolate bars, and I've chopped them up. Bedray is another great made in Oklahoma chocolate company. You can find these consistently at um, Ida Red on Peoria, so that's where I, where I get them. That's four Bedray chocolate bars all chopped up for us. Um, about a cup. And that gives it like a little crunchy taste. Oh, <laughs> it does. And I mean, in pieces like that is delicious. Then a cup of toffee bits, and you can find those like on a baking aisle. And pretzels, my favorite. And the pretzels, and I'm using Trucker Treats Pretzels, also made in Oklahoma. Really neat company founded by a truck driver who was making his own pretzels and then gave them to friends, and their friends were like, where can I buy these? So. I'm I'm just using the, the, the plain pretzels there, and he, what a neat company that is. So that mix all of those together really nicely, and then you can make these, you know, really into big cookies using a one-quarter scoop, or you can do little bitty cookies however you want to do. I've kind of done a mixture of both there. And then just scoop them out 350 degrees for, if you're doing big ones, 12 or 13 minutes, little ones, more like eight or nine minutes. and. That's it. Kind of flatten them down just a little bit so they'll bake evenly. Okay, and the finished product is great. Yes. You have to check it out. <laughs> yes. Okay, Natalie, thank you for always thank as joining you. us. Stay with us. We'll be right back after this break.